welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel if you don't know who i am i am chelsea on Hinawa. okay so today we are going to do a story time it's been a while i did a sit down for us to chit chat and talk you know so today that's what you're going to do and from my thumbnail you might have seen what this story time is all about so i've been working at starbucks for six months 17th april was my sixth month working at starbucks so i was on probation for for six months and then i'm finally off probation and i have some very very good news you all know that wherever i've worked since i've been to canada like people like me because i put in the work like i work hard because not because i'm working for the money but because i have to work hard and i like making sure that whatever i'm doing i'm doing a very good job and then i know i'm doing what i'm supposed to do so there'll be a background noise i want to apologize for that because i'm babysitting oh, the mom's on the phone so there's going to be some background noise so i've been working at starbucks for six months and the good news is at starbucks every six months you sit down with a store manager and then she asks you where do you want to be where do you see yourself in the company what do you want whether you want to be a shift supervisor whether you want to be a manager where do you want to see yourself and what you think they should improve on what do you think she can do better you know stuff like that so i think it's starbucks is one of the places i've worked that there is a system working for everyone starbucks doesn't even call their uh, they don't call their workers like employees or workers they call us partners because they see us as partners of the company so okay so guys i've been to so many jobs i've worked so many jobs since i've been to Kenya. i can't even count them they are uncountable but i feel the best place i've worked is Cora. i liked working at Cora so much i was playing something some other time not anytime soon about Cora. like i liked working at the place so much and the next best place i've worked is starbucks when i started working here i felt like i should quit because the drinks are too much getting to know what this drink is about getting to punch in the orders and the money like here you don't usually have handle cash because everything is card you just tap on your phone and stuff so at first they change changing money to people like someone will bring money up to give them change it was confusing me that they, they call two dollars tony like the coin they call one dollar i think looney or something i don't know if i've even mixed them so and they call 25 cents quarter so everything is used it was confusing i wanted to quit but guess what i stayed and then and now i'm doing so well i do so well at bar i'm fast i'm always fast when i go i'm doing so well and then so when we had that meeting with the manager she asked me that where do i see myself in the company in the coming i said i want to be a ship supervisor so she was like i'm still on probation you know i don't drive i don't have a car and then for ship supervisor i should be able because you sometimes open we open at 5 30 you have to be there at 5 30 you open at 6 but you have to be there at 5 30 to do the opening of the shop and stuff and then you close late like 10 30 so if you don't drive with quite difficult and you have to have an open availability but because of school i can't have an open availability so she was like i can't be a supervisor right now but it will take about three to two months or more people have been saying good things about me at work when she asks people about me they always say good things about me at work so but now she would promote me to a barista trainer so currently as we are speaking i'm no more a barista i'm a barista trainer and i wanted to do this video for a very long time but anytime i want to actually sit down i'm unable to sit down and talk to you guys so currently i'm a barista trainer i'll start my training this monday she's always postponing it because sometimes she's sick sometimes the weather and stuff but hopefully this monday i'll get it done so what a barista trainer is I will be training new baristas so when they hire someone barista is anybody anybody at the front making drinks punching your order all those people are baristas call them baristas so i came there as a barista 
I first applied for supervisor, but she said, I think she told me to change it to barista. I don't know why when I first applied. But I think it's good I started as a barista because it takes time to be able to get to know everything at Starbucks. So if I was if I jumped to supervisor, it would have been hell for me. I know someone that came with me that she couldn't stand it and then she had to quit. So but now she has promoted me to a barista trainer. So anytime they hire someone, I'll be the one training them. And anytime you train someone, they give you an extra hundred dollars on your paycheck. So guys, what I'm trying to tell you is sometimes I just want to advise you. Maybe some of you might be older than me. Some of you might think that I'm not probably fit enough to advise you, but wherever you are planted make sure you bloom make sure you do your best make sure that when you come in people are happy to see you like oh chelsea is coming like they're happy because when i come i can kill the drinks you know i i can kill it like i'll i'm fast i'm still trying i want to be faster like where i want to be at the bar like when i'm at the bar making drinks i'm not there yet people feel i'm fast but to me i think i can do better i want to be like fast do drinks under one minute no matter whether it's a frappuccino whether it's coffee whether it's a latte doesn't matter i want to be so fast so wherever people put you wherever you go to a job it doesn't matter there are so many people at starbucks where i work that i have a degree most of them are high school graduates but it doesn't matter it doesn't matter it doesn't matter there are shift supervisors that tell me when i go tell me to um you no know, chelsea today are going to drive through who i am way 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 older than most of them are kids like they are in, now in the university some are high school graduates some might not have even finished high school but they are ship supervisors i know people when they are coming they'll be like oh when you come here the whites they are they don't go to school and they'll be telling you to do this do that do that if you were comfortable in wherever that you are i don't think you would have moved here so when you come here you have to be humble learn watch and learn and whatever people tell you to do you do it you don't complain because it's just a face that is going to pass everything shall pass so you put in your best so today I don't even know how to sit what I came to tell you guys is your girl has been promoted to a barista trainer I wasn't even done with my probation and then I was promoted. Do you think it's everybody that goes to a job and then during probation they, pro they promote them? If I wasn't doing well, if I wasn't putting in my best, if I wasn't working hard, do you think there are so many people that I came to meet at Starbucks that are still baristas that have not been promoted? So why me? Think about it. Think about it because I put in my best. I work hard. When I was leaving Cora, they were so sad. Now, one girl used to text me all the time that they can't stop mentioning your name. They're always saying that if Chelsea was here, if Chelsea was here, if Chelsea was here. You know, so wherever you are planted, make sure you grow, you bloom, you work hard. Don't think about the money. I don't get paid any amount of Starbucks, but I love working there. At first, I didn't like working there when I first started, but now I'm happy to go to work, except when it's 5 30. But I love working at Starbucks. I'm happy I've been promoted. I'm looking to be a ship supervisor. I don't want to be a store manager. The highest I want to go is to be a ship supervisor. So I'm hoping the next time I make a video about Starbucks, you guys will know that I've been promoted to a ship supervisor. So let's look at in the next five, six. I'm giving myself by the end of the year, I should be a ship supervisor at Starbucks. So let's see how that goes. So thank you guys for coming to my sit down if you want more sit down like this i have so many stories that i want to sit down and talk to you guys but some things won't allow me to talk right now and when eventually i do a sit down and tell you why i couldn't talk about them you would understand me so well and like okay it makes sense i'll come your way same time next week with another video i have so much vlogs that you guys can watch you can check my description Put so many links that you can watch so many fun videos that you would like if you want to migrate to canada i have videos there if you want to learn some cooking videos i have them there if you want to have a one-on-one -on -one interview with someone that is new to canada and how they're surviving i have videos on it 
and life in canada vlogs i have everything so check on the link in my description box come your way same time next week with another video Thank you.